Hi Libra, it's L here to do your 72 hour energy reading. You're the last sign, so I'm like burned out. Um, but that doesn't mean you're not going to get a good reading, okay? <laughs> um, all links are below if you need to get in contact with me. Uh, let's go ahead and jump into this. Thank you, Lord God, for blessing Libra with a clear and concise message from you. So we'll start the reading with a quote. So the quote says, um, like the people who like you. Okay, so it's simply, let's stop chasing people who make us chase their validation, their likeness, their attention. Like the people who like you, deal with people who reciprocate. Um, it's much easier. You don't have to worry about toxic and karmic situations when you don't... When, how you start is how you finish. You start chasing them, you will always be chasing them. Till the end. So anyway, let's move on. Libra, the channel message I got off camera when I was meditating for you guys was um, just like a... saw the vision of like... Um, what are those... Uh, like those bottle rocket uh, fireworks going up in the air, but they were pink and blue. And then when I was like, well, I don't know what that means. And I closed my eyes again and I saw it again. I saw several of them, pink and blue bottle rockets going up. I don't know, you know, pink and blue is significant of you know, boy or girl. We do have the child card here and we have the knight of cups i don't know if you're going to be attending a uh, baby shower you get baby news or you got baby fever i'm not exactly sure there are two individuals that were going in two different paths or they they see life differently they it's just they're so different one is more Emotional, spiritual, culture. The other is about fun, adventure, moving, action, confidence. You know, uh, worldly matters. There could have been a breakdown in communication. Just a breakup altogether. Because we do have the Five of Cups. And someone is very sad about that. Someone is missing the other or is, is mutual. Someone just feels like they don't know how to bridge the gap. It's been so much time, energy that has transpired between the two of them not being together. It's like, well, how do I make it back home? And that's why that river is there because it, it's between this guy and home. So it's like, how do I get back? How do I get back to home? Someone is deeply concerned, maybe even being pessimistic about if this connection will come back together. Will this person, will we journey back together will we journey together will we come back will they arrive back in my life or is this a you know a definite departure you know somebody wants to start a new new relationship they want to i keep getting that somebody is now changing their mind somebody didn't want to have a family didn't want to have children Somebody left the connection or, you know, put it on pause and said, okay, whatever, I'll move on. And now somebody's mind is changing about family life and children. Um, someone wants to go in a new positive direction. Somebody is holding on to the other. You do have a dynamic of maybe divine masculine, divine feminine here. Somebody wants um, the real thing with the other person that left. Somebody wants to start this back up. They need to take the next step if they really do want this connection. Um, somebody is really seeing the connection for what it was and what it was worth or what it's worth um, that is significant in their life um, that they have to uh, cherish the other person, um, perform well in this relationship that someone is or a soulmate or is or was. But they're, the ending to a relationship happened here, but somebody's willing to put the work in. It looks like this is something that's been done over and over again between the two of you. Somebody's saying, look, it's better for us to be together than apart. 
let's just heal these severed ties. Bygones be bygones. Somebody may even try to show their love by gifts or gifting, trips, money. Somebody is stuck. Someone is wanting the other person to come and rescue them out of this negative stuck place. Somebody feels like they could be a power couple together. Or they were that. And they want it back. Somebody's trying to manifest this energy back. If you are uh, independent contractor, self-employed, there's going to be some unexpected money that opens up to a new pathway for you. You may have some intimate conversations with loved ones, maybe ones that you live in the home with. You give them a message about the home or about maybe you're moving out of the home. Again, somebody's stuck on you, Libra, or you stuck on them. Somebody is hoping, wishing, praying for their dreams to come true with you. They're in great despair about whatever happened. It could have been that there was another party introduced here. Somebody was listening to friends and or family or people outside of the connection. Once again, they're seeing that this is significant. This is a significant relationship in their life. It took for you leaving or them leaving for you to wake up to that. Things came easily to this person, especially women and or men, because they are wealthy. They're in a place of um, abundance and prestige. Somebody left the connection quick, fast, and in a hurry and left the other person feeling depleted, left out, lost, without. This person tried to maybe even seek counsel to get, you know, counsel about what they can do, how they can fix it or fix the connection. Somebody knows that they need to get this person back immediately because they're a good catch and they can be in another relationship quickly. Again, this relationship is going to take a lot of time. A lot of time, energy, and effort, and uh, work. Someone still may be trying to get away with something about having another connection here. But someone is definitely missing you or you missing them. So Libra, this is your reading. I hope that it resonates for you. Go over to the website, book your own reading there. If you have an idea or something you want to do, something you need to move on, move in, take the next step now. Break down your goals into small, you know, uh, feasible steps. You don't have to do everything at once. For some of you, it needs to be a new exercise program. Again, somebody is changing their mind about how they feel about you or the connection. Um, somebody has gone and had some spiritual growth. Someone's motivated to come back to you. Um, maybe because they are awakened to the journey that you both are on with this religion and spirituality. You may have young adult kids or adult kids that need to be courageous um, and take the next step maybe in leaving the nest. Uh, Money may be coming into you, and what you are seeking, you will find. Um, and it might be that you need to forgive. Okay. All right. All links are below. Get your own personal reading at the website level. If you have a question or two, you can text it to the number below. Pay for your question. Receive the answer to your question on your mobile device. Thank you, Libra. Many blessings to you. Take care.